We're here today looking at the new P1716 Chrome. 1716 is a 117 day hybrid that flowers like a 113 day hybrid. It's made for the corn on corn acres, medium tall plant structure with medium ear placement. The roots come out a little bit late than nodal roots do, so it's early roots pre-tassel are very average but late roots are strong and that showed up last year especially in the Republican River Valley when we had a lot of late winds and we had some late root lodging occurring uh, this one stood up very well for late roots good ear flex to it uh, with rows about 16 rows around the grain is food grade quality very high test weight corn it has outstanding toughness it's got a drought rating of eight, just missing the Aquamax mark. But with its early silk, strong roots, big tassel, uh, this is an excellent canopy. This is a very good dry land to limited irrigation hybrid. This would be an excellent hybrid in the Platte Valley for high moisture corn and silage, for the top end yield environments to the tough dry land corners. What it really excels in is as we move south into the Republican River Valley and we start moving into dry land and limited irrigation acres. 1760 really excelled last year in the Republican River Valley with its more moderate plant structure, a bit stronger roots than what we've had in this maturity, and its toughness. The new P1716 Chrome is going to be an excellent hybrid in this maturity, adding a great corn on corn option for us. That concludes this Pioneer Agronomy video podcast. Visit our page on pioneer.com and follow us on Twitter and Facebook for more agronomy insights.